All right, boys and girls, before we start this assignment, you'll need scissors and your rainbow name that we did in class yesterday. This is our scissors chant, and this helps us remember how to hold our scissors and how to cut with our scissors. So you can say it along with me once you play it and learn it. This is our scissors chant. This is how it goes. Open, shut, open, shut. That's the way we cut, cut, cut. Fingers on the bottom, thumb on top. Do not let the paper drop. Open, shut, open, shut. That's the way we cut, cut, cut. Let me show you what that means. So when we open scissors, we open, shut, open, shut. That's the way we cut, cut, cut. Fingers on the bottom, and my fingers on the bottom, and my thumb is on top. Make sure your thumb is on the top, not on the bottom. It's hard to hold the scissors like that. So fingers on the bottom, thumb on top. Do not let the paper drop. That means this hand is the, is the driver. This hand is gonna hold the paper. Because look what happens if I don't hold it. It's hard to cut. So I have to hold it with this hand, drive the paper, and open, shut, open, shut. Do not let the paper drop. And look, this hand just keeps opening and shutting, opening and shutting, and this hand is the driver. If I wanna cut this curly line, I'm going to cut, and this hand is gonna drive. So I'm gonna drive that way, and just keep opening and shutting, and then I'm gonna drive that way. This hand is moving it back and forth. And I'm gonna drive back that way. And then I'm gonna drive back that way. And if it's still hard for you, that's okay. That's why we're practicing. Now we're ready for your rainbow name. All right, boys and girls, yesterday we made, we read the story Alma, and we learned about how our names make us special. You all have a special name. This is one of my students' names from last year and I made rainbow writing on her name. And yesterday we also drew lines, making a line between each letter in our name. So today we're gonna practice with our cutting because yesterday we also learned, today we also learned about scissors. So we learned our rhyme where we say, fingers on the bottom, all my fingers go in the bottom, thumb on top. We don't wanna have them upside down Make sure your fingers are on the bottom. Sometimes you can put three fingers in there. I like to put four fingers in these big scissors. And my thumb is on top. Do not let the paper drop. That means I can't just cut and dr drop my hand down. This hand is the driver. This hand has a very important job. So you can drive with this hand and this hand just cuts straight down the road. So when I'm cutting, if I have to turn a corner, this is the hand that turns the corner. This hand just keeps cutting. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna cut right on the lines that we drew with a dark color, and we're gonna cut all of these letters apart. And I'm just doing my best. Remember, don't let the paper drop. Gotta hold it with this driving hand and cut with my cutting hand. I'm gonna do that with all my pieces. I also have a dark line here. I'm gonna cut these apart. That one's a pretty easy one. I have to hold it with this hand, cut. Hold it with this hand, cut. All right, so now I have all these pieces, all these letters, but I have two names, and we just made ourselves two puzzles. Now the fun part starts. Now you have to put your puzzle back together. I have to try to find the letters in my name. This is my, my friend's name. And I have to put them in order um, so I can make the name all over again. This is actually pretty tricky. It's good luck, boys and girls, because it's a little tricky. And then after you make your name one time, you try to make it with the rest of your letters and put them in order. If you want, you can challenge a family member to put your puzzles together. 